I have a feeling this episode is going to be a more of a slower one, kind of getting us into that next little mini arc because it's called Home slash the Hearthfire Mansion, which we know Hestia is hearth. That's like her whole thing. So like this is going to be us in our new house, kind of feeling out our new digs, all that kind of stuff. I'm excited. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius, back at it again. Don Machi, episode five. Last episode, we had the winning of the war game, the dissolving of Apollo's familia. All of this stuff is ours, all that jazz. I'm super excited. It was a great end to a great arc. We got a lot stronger, got some new people in the familia. Overall, just amazing. Um, but I'm not gonna talk anymore. I'm just excited to hop into this. So without any further ado, if you guys want full length and early access to this show, all the other shows I'm watching, make sure to check out that Patreon down below. If Patreon's not really your thing and you guys still wanna support me, if you guys could just leave a like and a nice comment. And if you guys are new, don't forget to smash that subscribe button, turn on that bell for all those notifications so you guys know exactly when my erratic schedule posts my stuff because you guys know it's pretty crazy. But uh, don't forget to follow me on all my socials, Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, at Dapper Darius. Let's follow or let's go. Um, Don Machi, season two, episode five, home slash the Hearthfire Mansion. Thank you, Soma. <laughs> probably like a big deal he never does anything besides work on the wine talk about the wine and do anything like that so him saying take care of yourself especially with all the traumatic experience she went through growing up heck yeah she's finally free with our new logo with our new home jesus christ like look how far we've come from episode one I'd say this is enough for celebrating, yeah, our victory in the war game. <laughs> hey, those are all great things. We'll have a toast to all of them. He's the real deal, little rookie my ass. Commander Bell has a nice little ring to it, doesn't it? I'll cheers to that. Kanpai! Nice. I was about to, I was literally joke I was gonna joke around and say a hot tub, but no, it's seriously a hot bath. I mean, if he's the god of architecture, he has to be top-notch builder. I only would expect the best, which he delivered. So, Goibnu family. Gotta write that down. He's the architecture guy. So they all got something they wanted. He got his blacksmith station. Mikoto got her hot bath. He's going to be able to make so many dope we items, weapons, whatever here. Hell yeah. My divine authority. That's fucking comedy. Daphne and Cassandra, which someone commented. Uh, man, I got to get better remembering the names uh, who commented. Um, Daphne is the blue hair right but they said daphne because all this is based off like a vast majority of the show has a lot of ties to actual mythology so daphne is someone in greek mythology who had these 100 percent prophetic pro uh, prophecies that were always accurate but no one would believe her so it's like the exact same which is just hilarious to me i just love that you know she said it like nine times she's like we should probably should not fight bell I'll believe your dream. I believe it. Bell believes her. Oh. It fell behind a pillar. There you go. 
Coño, coño, coño. Coño, coño, coño. What's going on tomorrow? What did Hestia do? I love the ambition, I love the drive, but oh my god. Elves, dwarves, animal people, Amazon. Her character type overlaps with mine. Oh my god. Do not touch. What is this, like the audience at a concert? Ooh. Okay, Belle's cute. What? And of course, that happens right in front of the audience of people. No. Wow. This is for the blade. Oh, that's why I thought it was for the renovations. That's why two. She was gonna pay off two hundred million with her job. That's how much that knife cost. I like how it shows the flashbacks for the scenes in the background when he was using the knife. He is. <laughs> that is comedy. He's bedridden. Yeah. Yeah, start. Well, good. That's good. That lets us get back in the go back to the dungeon. Nah, come on, you need us. That's hilarious. <laughs> also true. Bath is a good spot. Don't get Hestia and Belle in the same bath together. They're just all hanging out, dicks just flopping. Yeah, let's just look at each other's muscles while dicks are just flopping. Hey, no judgments here. Bell's or Hestia's hearing about his more defined muscles. I love the camera work. Very rare that it's the girl speaking on the guys in anime. This is such a nice emotional, sentimental moment going on while these girls are trying to peek. Everybody's listening in. Everybody's listening in. 
にいてくれる僕の初めての仲間エル様<笑>それに神様 All the girls are loving it right now 全部神様がくれたんだダメな神様って言われちゃうこともあるけどでも僕にとっては何よりも大切で最高の神様なんだ<笑> Aww Hestia loves that. <laughs> That's so cute. How do they not hear you on the other side? They're talking at a whisper, and you can hear what they're saying, yet you're screaming. I was about to say, do not fall over. They're trying to pull her back. Oh my god, I've said it before, but how much would I love to be Belle? How much? So much. Oh. Something happened with Luca? Oh no, are we gonna have bad vibes to end our good vibes? Who is that? What happened? What is going on? No! That she would- what? <sighs> so I'm so curious about that ending. I'm sure I'm going to get more answers on this next episode that I'm about to watch, but... Like I said, I, I assume this episode was going to be more of a slower one, get us used to this new house, get us into this next little mini arc, which seems like a good reason for us to get really back into the dungeons is to pay off this discovered debt that Hestia had, which is 200 million, which is a, a lot. Um, but, you know, we can, we can do some pretty amazing tasks together. Hopefully we can do it. Uh, Hestia has this new ambition to not be a minor familia anymore. I didn't, I didn't think that recruiting thing was going to work out. Maybe we would have got Daphne and Cassandra, but, uh, I do like that we were, that Belle was the only one to believe her and she instantly liked him because of that. But like I said, good episode, good little quick one to get back us back in this new arc. I'm so curious about that ending and that Chienthrope, that that half human, half animal. So curious why Chigusa had to come. To, I was so sure something happened to Uka. I was like, oh, did he die? That would suck. Cause Uka was, he's goaded. But I think I'm about to just hop into this next one. Remember, if you guys want early access, full length, all that jazz, check out that Patreon down below. I'll see you guys soon. Peace out, Dapper Squad. Thank <laughs> you.